So, content has been great recently, if you couldn't tell. So yeah, I'm coming on here today because I wanted to try something new. I wouldn't say that this is entirely new, but yes guys, by the title, we are going to be reacting to some of the coolest people on TikTok, because I figured, why not? We've been covering a lot of news and drama on this channel recently, and I figured, hey, why not have a free upload here of just pure entertainment? These people on TikTok who are literally the coolest people ever. Like, let's just take a look. Chocolate syrup! Chocolate powder! Milk! Perfect! So we got this guy, he likes, I don't even know, supersizing everything, and what really stinks and what's really cringe about it is that this guy will waste so much food. Like, there is this video of him where he dumps milk and chocolate syrup, powdered chocolate, just all those things, and he'll do it in mass quantities. Like, he'll take two gallons of milk and just dump it all over the place. He'll dump the chocolate syrup, and that will get all over too. And he ends up just making this big mess. And he does this with a lot of things, because I don't I don't know maybe he thinks he's funny or something or he does it because he knows the video is gonna blow up and people are gonna enjoy the video when in reality he's just wasting all of this food and i really hate to be this way but you know how much food is wasted here in the u.s and in the world every year according to feeding america around 108 billion pounds is the total food waste every year like that's just insane and then we got this guy over here just adding to that and his goal at the end of the day isn't to eat that his goal is to get a viral video off of it like that's all that people want these days is clout on TikTok and they'll do anything to get it. We got this guy. And you might be asking, what is he doing, Brion? Well, to that question, I don't know either. Just take a look. So if you were wondering what the actual song was playing, since I can't play it because it's copyright music, it's basically that song by Echo Smith, the Cool Kids song. And this is a good song, not gonna lie, but in this TikTok, the song that was playing was like some weird cringe remix of the song, and this guy was like voice syncing to it or whatever. And let me just say this now. Does this guy not look like a saber-toothed tiger? Are you not seeing the resemblance here? Like, guy really came back from the dead and from being extinct. Like, what is he talking about glow up? More like a glow down. They got rid of most of the fur. Like, I'm honestly really surprised that the saber tooth tiger heard about the platform TikTok and decided to come back so they could get all the clout. I mean, at this point, I think I'm taking it too far. Let's move on. Am I the only one who cringe died after watching this video? Like, do people really act like this on TikTok? Okay, never mind. I don't even know why I'm asking that because, I mean, it's like, what did I even expect at the end of the day? I mean, at least come over here on YouTube and make some content or something. Don't do whatever the hell this video is that you just made. Like, do you think that people are going to find this flattering and attractive? Like, at this point, are humans just turning into monsters whenever they make a TikTok video? Like, this honestly just baffles me at the end of the day. Is this really what? What people do like i couldn't even tell what emotion this was like was this happy sad mad i mean i think it's just all three combined into one at the end of the day i say that way too much but i don't care wait i gotta go check something real quick so you're telling me that this person has 1.7 million followers on tiktok from doing whatever this is Yeah, guys, I don't know what to say anymore except for, yeah, I don't know. I'm not watching this anymore. Sorry, but I thought things were really down bad when we saw the last video. But no, I think this one is honestly just 10 times worse than all of these combined. Like, what is even going on? I've seen this before, but I've seen it with dogs and like females trying to be dogs. Come on. No, come on. Let's go. Let's go. Hey. Hey. hey go. Come on, Jenna, go. Let's go. Bad girl. Let's go. Keep walking. 
but like cats and they're actually being a bowl and you actually licking the milk out of the bowl i mean okay dress up as a cat but i i don't know about this one and just the fact that it got almost 700 000 likes on it and people are always asking me why i don't like tiktok and i literally just send them any one of my tiktok videos like the videos i made reacting to tiktoks and they instantly understand why because if i'm going down tiktok any day and i just see this coming down my timeline if that's what you even call it man i'm just instantly deleting the app like once again i don't understand how people enjoy this content maybe i'm more of a fan of long form content but at the same time i'll watch youtube shorts and they won't have any of this weird cringy stuff on there like i'm watching down there and it's actually good content this is just random honestly bullshit that people post to get likes and views it's quite sad but another thing i wanted to talk about is that one day i was going through tiktok and the news feeds and stuff like that and i found this one video of a challenge i don't know it was like called knock down the fence challenge or something and just take a look at how stupid it is and that's another thing i'm surprised i didn't show this to anyone except for my friends because it's really that bad just take a look at this this surveillance video shows a group of several people charging another fence at this home and the footage went viral on social media getting the attention of law enforcement uh, they get into a group mentality where one of them thinks they have a good idea and the other ones go along with it and i can tell you from experience in law enforcement once we meet up with these kids individually they tend to say they're sorry and didn't wouldn't do this by themselves peak secondhand embarrassment like what do i even have to say about this video do i really have to point out the idiocracy so we got this many kids because there's no way these are adults we got this many kids at like 3 a.m in the morning going to go charge a fucking wooden fence let that just sit with you for a second a wooden fence for absolutely no reason for literally tiktok clout it's getting to the point where not even your fence is out outside are even safe from this like god forbid you even have a wooden fence out there because it's gonna be gone tomorrow because the neighborhood kids are just gonna bulldoze it like geez can we calm down for once in our lives like i really hope that the police found these people because you can't just be doing this stuff like just imagine that that was your fence you know how expensive it is just to put up a fence around your yard like i hope these people make these kids pay for a new fence in full no mercy this is how far we're stooping down for tick TikTok challenges, let alone that it's not guaranteed that you do blow up from these videos. Very sad society we're living in right now. And yeah, it actually turns out that these kids did not pay a single cent to the person who actually owns this fence, or what was once a fence. They basically just apologized for it and didn't get any punishment. And the guy in this video that I showed you, because that wasn't all of the video, he states that it was around $800 to repair it. Expensive shit. Now, if you want to do a TikTok challenge, I I understand something like i don't know you go around pranking your friends or something doing harmless pranks things that won't get you in trouble or get you killed okay i understand it but when you do things like this when you literally pull a patrick from spongebob and go charging in the shit and breaking it and then running off like you can get yourself in trouble and also you're hurting other people because that guy now has to pay 800 something dollars to get the fence replaced basically like bro tiktok i don't like it now i'm not saying everything on tiktok is bad but there is a lot of stuff out there that is really bad on that platform. And I personally don't like it because I always get every five videos down my feed, some random girl dancing, and I don't I don't want to watch that. But yeah, I think I'm going to wrap up the video there. Thank you so much for watching. Thank God I made it out alive after making this video. Because man, I don't know if I can take any more of that. If you enjoyed this video and you thought it was a good video, make sure you hit the like button. So it will promote it more in the algorithm so more people will find the video and potentially enjoy it. If you're new to the channel and you like this video make sure you subscribe because i am trying to hit 15,000 subscribers if you have any questions comments concerns opinions on these people making these dumb tiktok challenge videos make sure you leave the comment down in the comment section down below and last thing i just wanted to talk about my recent upload schedule yes there's literally nothing to talk about and i'm sorry i'm gonna start expanding to more content if there's no drama so stay tuned for that school's over and all that so i'm gonna try and get onto the grind once again trust me i didn't die i'm still here at least for now and uh yeah thank you guys so much for watching the video my name is brion and i will see you in my next video peace